Hello happy people, Hamza here and welcome to this video. In my Elementor series about exciting Elementor extensions, today I'm going to take you through an exciting tool called Ultimate Add-ons for Elementor. And I hope you'll find this video of value to you. Enjoy the video. At the moment, I am at the homepage of Ultimate Add-ons for Elementor. And when you come over here to the Elementor widgets, they will basically list for you all the available widgets in their package. However, when you scroll down here, you also see the same list of elements or widgets. For example, you have like info boxes, model pop-ups, duo color heading, before and after slider widget, advanced heading, multi-button, fancy heading, content toggle, and a lot more other widgets right here. However, I'm just going to take you through those widgets that actually caught my eye or that I found unique. And I think that you would need them also in your web design journey. The model pop-up is actually like a pop-up, only that these are already pre-designed or pre-made uh, pop-ups in Ultimate Add-ons for Elementor. For example, this is a content fed in and scale pop-up, just like this. So by basically installing and activating this plugin, you can have access to model pop-ups of this kind. This is a video embed and it is actually sliding from the top saved page template so you can even scroll through that we have a saved widget this is actually a contact form widget next is the dual color heading uh, you can create headings of this sort see this is one single heading and the same right down here you basically have the heading just one single heading but having multi colors and it's very simple you simply pick up the widget and then you style it up based on what you want this is the normal section and then the highlight section normal section highlight section and you can even add a background and also change typography for both the headings and the beauty is that ultimate add-ons for elementor has also made video tutorials for each of the available widgets that you would want to use next is the content toggle and here they say Use the content toggle widget of the ultimate add-ons for Elementor and allow users to switch between two kinds of content, save templates or even pages. Look at this. Now that is what the toggle does. You can simply have a save template like this or even you can have pages that you can enable people to toggle or switch in between. See how this looks like? already the widgets down here are changed so this can be a template that you already designed using elementor and then also this being another template and you can simply enable the switch between using the toggle widget next on my list is the table widget which i found really interesting in case you really want to create tables or even searchable tables in your elementor website now when you scroll down here there is a demo for a searchable table for example when i say this it will try to search up that specific query that i enter which i really find unique in case you are working with very very long tables or you basically want to have a table whereby you'll highlight the header row and the header column then ultimate add-ons for elementor table widget is something you look up for you also have a video tutorial that can help you in creating your tables using ultimate add-ons for elementor Next on my list is the who add to cut widget. Look at this. So you can add these call to actions in your Elementor website using this widget. See how this looks like. And there you go. Now the other one that you actually also have to look at is the who products widget. Of course, there's also a video tutorial here on how to set up that. But just to take you through, see how these products look like. You even have a add to cut widget right here even if you want to see a bigger version of that image it's available here see how this looks like look at this layout i think this looks beautiful and unique from what you get from uh, the default product showcase in uh, woocommerce or even the storefront theme see how this looks like and then you also have the pagination right down here so that's how the products widget looks like in Ultimate Add-ons for Elementor. Next, we are going to look at the marketing button. I bet you've not seen this before. Look at this. Look at this. 
and look at this and here they say create conversion friendly call to actions with highly customizable marketing button of the ultimate add-ons for elementor and the good thing you can add icons gradients even you can align text to the left to the center to the right and a lot more customizations that you can do with this button for example you can even create buttons of this sort and right down here they say you can add icons text alignment image background and they are fully responsive next on the list are the hotspots look at this look at this i find it unique that if you can add hotspots to your images then it makes it easier for your clients to really identify different hotspots or places within your images for example if you're going to develop a website like for a city then you can use the hotspot widget to basically mention places within that image or photo and actually to insert hotspots it's very easy once you have the ultimate add-ons for elementor enabled and then you get the hotspot widget you can simply just add over these hotspots right to that image and with the particle backgrounds you can add interactive row and column backgrounds with the animated particles moving around using the particle background have a look at how this looks like basically a whole section you simply just have to enable the particle background widget and then you can add an image and then you also select the kind of particles that you want to be animated in that specific section you can also create stuff like this actually when you realize that when i hover over down right here the particles kind of get also animated so you can have stuff like that the same like here too having hats flying all over and down here too okay uh, next we can have a look at the wp form styler so the wp form styler is like the gravity form styler and maybe the contact form styler only that this works with the wp forms only the beauty is that you have the ability to make changes to any of these form fields and you can customize the background uh, the typography and the buttons on this form and like here they say boxed and underlined form styles manage field sides and padding take control of the margins between the fields and that aside you can also manage colors for all the form fields typography options for everything seen on the form and dedicated color options for error and success messages that's basically what you can do with the wp form styler the best thing is actually you to check it out and see a lot more on what you can do with this extension my second last is a retina image widget that can help you to enable high quality display of images on your elementor website now when you look at this the normal image looks like this however if you use the retina widget you simply have high quality images display up on your website and like here they say all modern devices incorporate retina images display normal images when viewed on such high definition screens look blurred and leave a bad impression for your visitors on the advanced controls you actually have this widget lets you to add a small logo or a large hero image anything that will suit your section with and then you can even add custom captions and custom links to this section the very last element or widget that i found interesting is the user registration forms that you can build using ultimate add-ons for elementor you can create custom user registration forms you can even register our users online or on your store or on your website and you can even add customized registration form for membership websites or even a participation form for your forum or e-learning websites and the beauty is that you can customize literally everything on this form and you can provide a specific url that people will access that form whenever you want them to get registered and the other thing you can collect any kind of data from names emails and a lot more other things the beauty is that you can actually stop spammers and fake registrations from taking over this form by enabling either the honeypot or the google recapture i've actually created a specific tutorial on how to enable google recapture on your elementor or wordpress website and i'm going to link it up right here in the card or in the description box below that aside you can perfectly customize this form to suit your needs and the other thing you have to know is that these forms are perfectly responsive on any device
now the very last we have to look into the pricing in case you want to get this extension for your elementor website now they have two pricing models there is the annual model and the lifetime model so with the annual model you can get this extension at 69 dollars the others are actually agency bundles and mini bundles which you'll actually get with a bundle of other products from brainstorm force who are actually the developers of ultimate add-ons for elementor but to focus on ultimate add-ons for elementor with a 69 bundle you'll have the possibility even to white label this plugin you'll have access to nice looking woocommerce widgets a read to left support one-to-one -one support and also extensive training and unlimited website usage if we go to lifetime plan this extension comes at 249 dollars and on top of that you'll have unlimited support and unlimited updates so thank you so much for watching i hope this video brought you value in case you have any comments questions please consider leaving them down in the comment box below if you are new to this channel please consider hitting the subscribe button and the bell icon so that you don't miss out on new content when i push it out and if you like this video please consider hitting the like button thank you so much for watching and see you in my next video